strengthening interoperability together with other maritime law enforcement agencies in the Visayas area of responsibility. A good Navy is not a provocation to war. It is the surest guarantee of peace. A quote by U.S. President Theodore Roosevelt. Welcome to the opening uh, ceremony of uh, Exercise Kadagatan 2023. Uh, after months of preparation, uh, today uh, we will once uh, again uh, witness and endeavor uh, today's commencement of the field uh, training exercise Katagatan 2023. Bantay Kadagatan 2023 is an annual unit training conducted by Naval Forces Central utilizing surface floating assets of the Naval Task Force 50. It is steered in conjunction with the interagency exercise together with other law enforcement agencies. This year's focus is to enhance interoperability, develop camaraderie, and strengthen coordination between Naval Forces Central, Philippine National Police Regional Maritime Unit 7, Coast Guard District Central Visayas, Philippine Drug Enforcement Agency 7, Bureau of Customs, and Bureau of Fisheries and Aquatic Resources in the conduct of interagency operations. This evaluate and assess the trainings, tactics, and procedures for a unified and synchronized interagency maritime operations. Let us continue to work in synergy and leverage our respective strengths for our resources to ensure a comprehensive and coordinated response to emerging challenges together so that we can address complex security issues and contribute to our maritime nation's development. Headed by the Commander, Naval Forces Central, Commodore Florante N. Gagua, Philippine Navy, as the officer scheduling the exercise. Deputy Commander, Naval Forces Central, Captain Raul A. Reyes, Philippine Navy, General Staff Corps, as the officer conducting the exercise. And the Commander, Naval Task Group 50.1, Commander Jason F. Simato, Philippine Navy, as the exercise director. The exercise planning preparation phase through concept development planning begun last February 28, 2023, during the concept development conference which was participated by the Naval Forces Central Staff Officers, Operations Officers of the Naval Task Force 50 Surface Assets, and representatives from the different maritime interagencies. Initial planning conference and final planning conference were conducted virtually and face-to-face -face aboard headquarters Naval Forces Central on March 30 and May 17, 2023, respectively. lectures were conducted by different agencies, wherein they discussed fishing law enforcement maritime operations, comprehensive filing and handling of cases, lectures on oil spill response operations, compliant and visit board search and seizure operations, surveillance and detection of contraband goods and illegal drugs. On the second day of the event, tabletop exercise, communications exercise, and rehearsals were conducted in a whole day activity. A pre-sale brief was conducted a day prior to the execution of the sea phase event. Likewise, day three events include sortie out, intelligence, surveillance, reconnaissance, photo exercise, 
Interagency Maritime Interdiction Operations, Compliant and High Risk Visit Board Search and Seizure, Maritime Surveillance and Reconnaissance, Maritime Search and Rescue, Oil Spill Response Operations. By the power uh, vested in me as the officer scheduling the exercise, I hereby declare Exercise Bantay Kadagatan 2023 open effective this day. Successful operations is actually being uh, precursored by preparation. And this is actually what you are doing to ensure that we will be successful in the incoming operations that we're going to have. The closing ceremony of the field uh, training exercise, Bantay Kadagatan 2023, denotes a meaningful uh, experiential learning in the operational and training readiness of our unit. Once again, I'd like uh, to congratulate all of you for a uh, job well done and hopefully this will continue and uh, I also urge our uh, stakeholders and our partners to really uh, work and not only work with us, train with us and be able to really um, cement the bond that we're having in terms of our operational uh, objectives. With that, my congratulations again, uh, Commodore Gagwa, for a job well done. Of course, uh, Captain Reyes and the uh, Exercise Director, and to all the participants for this year's uh, Bantay Katagatan 2023. My congratulations, my commendations, and allow me to thank all of you for a job well done. Bravo, Sulu! Exercise Bantay Kadagatan 2023 was successfully conducted through the cooperation and collaboration between the different maritime interagencies in the Visayas region, thus strengthening the maritime integrity and security for a safe, 
peaceful and progressive Visayas and maritime nation.